Hey guys, this is 2 guy 2 guy 2 from the Warriors Squad Craft here. And today I'm going to show you how to make a Minecraft ser server on Windows 10. So the latest version of Minecraft out is currently 1.9.2, which means I'm going to be making a server for that version. So what you need to first do is you need to go to the Minecraft website. Um, the I'll put the link in the description. And then go click on that little lines thing. Click on download. I click on set up the set up your own Minecraft server and download. Press keep and um, then make a folder on your desktop called um, whatever you want. So I'll call it server. Now you want to drag um, your um, file that you downloaded into the server folder and then create a new text document called run dot bat. Now press uh, accept whatever uh, warning they're giving you because uh, it doesn't really matter. And then copy this underneath the download on the same page and then paste it into here. Now you're going to want this file and this name to have the same um, name so just so just rename it so on 1.9.2 and now the same name just save and I'll, uh, double click on run.bat and so it's starting your server but then it crashes immediately and this is because you need to accept the ULA which is the um, agreement that you agree to when you buy Minecraft so depending on when you bought it you may have bought the most recent version of or accepted the most recent version of the EULA, but it's still good to review it um, just to make sure you're following the rules. Um, and so just copy this, paste it in, go to the page. Now uh, make sure you read everything. Um, and then if you agree, then change this EULA equals false to EULA equals true. Wait. True. Now I can close this and click, double click on run.bat again. Now I'll show a bunch of errors because basically you don't have all the files yet and so it needs to load them. And then once it goes loading and now it's loaded but we want to change the settings for the server so I just type stop. stop. And it'll just close down the server. Now, open server.properties, and these are all the settings for your server. So you have um, whether you can open, whether you can go to the Nether, what file um, the world file is. So that is currently this world file, but it um, it'll change um, what file it runs as the world file if you change this. Um, it goes and you have a ton of other settings um, like difficulty is like peaceful or easy, normal, hard. Then you have MOTD. I'm going to change this. This is the only one that I'm going to change for now. So this is basically, um, basically if you run Minecraft now this, this is all these little messages here um, that you see Normally they're not super colored uh, like that, but um, you'll be able to just put a message there. So now I'm going to change this to show you. I'm going to name it uh, My Server. Come play. Now let's just save this file. Now let's run run.bat again. And now there's it loads up a lot faster now that it's created all these files. And also there's no errors. So let's join the server. So this file, um since since it's run since it's running on your computer, you can just type in localhost and it'll just connect to the server on your that's hosted on your computer. Now let's refresh so that we can see 
um, the MOTD, so my server, come play. That's what we typed in. Let's join. You can see here, it will be saying, 2K2K2 is joining. Or, it should... I spoke too soon. Let's cancel this. Play again. That's strange. Let's restart the server. Stop. Um, what just happened? Oh. Stop. Nope. Oh, whatever. Uh, let's run this again. Nope. Play. Okay, there. Now, we, we're joining the server. So we're on the server. And as you can see here, it says 2K2K2 two 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 logged in. 2K2K2 uh, two 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 joined the game. Um, now, let's say I want to op me, so op 2k2k2. Two two two. So now I can run commands, before I couldn't. Uh, so I can do game mode 1. Um, so that this is how to make a Minecraft server. Uh, there are a few commands that are just for servers, so op, deop, ban, uh, pardon, um, ban IP, stop, uh, I think there are a few others, but, um, well, yeah, so, now, at this current moment, you can only join this server, um, if you're on your network, so, anybody outside of your network cannot join the server, which is a problem. Uh, you are going to want to be able to, um, well, you don't have to, but if you want somebody else to be able to connect to your server that's outside of your network, you're going to have to research some port, or about port forwarding. Um, port forwarding is basically how you connect your server to the internet. Now, just remember, port forwarding can be dangerous, um, for your network, but if you don't port forward, which is how the server that I've shown you how to make so far is, there shouldn't be any worry, unless somebody is on your network, um, that could hurt your computer. So, let's do kick, do kai two kai two. Um, so, now, Currently, all you know how to do is how to join on your own computer. So, sorry about that. So, now, to be able to have other people in your network connect to your server, what you need to do is you need to um, open this thingy, Cortana, um, and search up con control panel. Now, open this, and, we, and what you need to do is search up adapter, I have no idea why. Uh, view network connections on network and sharing center. Double click on this and now press details. Now what you need to do is if you need to find this, so I'm going to copy that down. Um, Notepad++. Plus plus. I have it copied down here. Let's close all that. Um, and so now We've got the IP, so open Minecraft up again. Multiplayer. And so now we have this Minecraft server. Oh, let's run server. But let's say instead of being able, to, we, we can't do local host in this case if you're on a different computer. So what happened? Um, so, what you need to do is you need to copy that down. So it was, let's see, what, what, what was it? Well, it was 
my IP is 10.0.0.233. Now, this is only for my computer. This is not for my network, which is why it will work in the network and not um, on all the internet. So press done. It's loaded. Now let's refresh. My server can play. Let's play. So, there we go. Uh, no. So, now we've got our server. Anybody on your network can connect to it. And, well, there you go. Thanks for watching and please subscribe. Bye.